Hi, I'm JG. Uh, you're probably here because you've downloaded my WonderKit add-on for Football Manager 2020, but are having trouble getting the faces to work. Uh, so I made a quick video to show you how to fix this. The first thing you need to do is to make sure that you have the required programs downloaded. For this, you need Bulk Rename Utility and FM XML. Download links to both those can be found on the downloads page on the FM Scout website, where you also found the download for this uh, add-on. Aside from that, you also need to make sure that in your preferences inside Football Manager, you have this one ticked. You can kind of see it here. Show screen IDs in title bar to assist skinning. You're going to need that, so make sure that is ticked and then click reload skin and confirm. Great. So then you should see, if you didn't have it before, you should now see the ID up here. Good. So I assume you've already installed the download pack. So you've placed the FMF file in your editor data folder and you've placed the faces folder inside your graphics folder. Uh, so I'm just going to go into mine here and these are the default file IDs. So the first person here is Shane Clivert, who is also the player I have open here on my FM in the background. As you can see, the file name here and the ID here do not match. So that's what we need to do. In order to do this, you need to open up bulk rename utility here. And then you need to load in the folder where the faces from the add-on are. As you can see, I've already done that here. So that's just wherever you place it. Then you need to, honestly, you need to untick most of these. Uh, so rejects, replace, name and case, just untick them all. Under remove, just add a value that's high enough to make sure all the names get cleared. So 50 or 110 is technically enough and might as well go higher. Uh, add you don't need, auto date you don't need, numbering you do need. Here you collect mode and then it doesn't matter if you choose prefix or suffix, just one of them. And here where it says start, here is where you need to take the skin ID that we found in the FM. So here where it says 19, 15, 38, 83, 72. That number we need to type in here where it says start. So what did it say? 19, 15, 38, 83, 72. Great. Everything else you just leave alone. Untick move copy parts. Untick append folder name. Untick extension. And... Yeah, then just make sure everything except the config file is selected. Uh, and then you click rename. Boom. All right, that should be it for bulk rename utility. As you can see, now everything here has been renamed. What you need to do now is open FMXML and browse towards the folder. Or if you're smart, you can just uh, click and drag the relevant folder into here. Then you need to make sure make config.xml file is checked. You need to make sure faces is checked and all file names are IDs is checked. And then you click go. There. And as long as you get a success message, everything is fine. Uh, but that should be it. Then once you go onto FM and just click reload skin. And if we just wait a minute and it should be fine. And there you have it. As you can see, the face for Shane Clivert is now loaded. The important thing is that you always take the ID from Shane Clivert. Uh, the reason for that is quite simply, he is the first one in the list. In theory, if you say you didn't have Spain loaded, you could start with someone else. You can find the, the order and the IDs in the Excel, far, the Excel file that's in the download folder. So let's say you only have England loaded, you'd probably start with Omari Hutchinson, which is uh, this guy here. And then you just kind of count back to where the starting point should be. Um, but yeah, everything should work now. I can just uh, show you a few of the players here. See, he's got a face. He's also one I've added. Uh, who else can we check? Of course, not blanking. So, Chanino. so everyone should have a face now. And that should uh, really be it. So uh, I hope uh, this tutorial was helpful for you. I know a lot of people have been asking questions. Uh, so I hope you enjoy my database.